Happy Wednesday, Gladiators. I'm John Christofferson. And I'm Jada McDonald, and this is your KWHS News. If you still haven't turned in your federal aid card, please be sure to do that immediately. Attention juniors and seniors, college visits this month include Grand Canyon University, who rescheduled for today. November visits start with UNC Greeley on the 1st, DU on November 8th, and Savannah College of Art and Design on November 9th. Lamar Community College will be here on November 10th, and CSU Fort Collins closes out the month of November with a visit on November 17th. Remember to get your pass from the Counseling Center to attend any of these sessions. Seniors, just like in your days in high school, your days to send in your baby ads and senior photos are limited. They are due this Friday, and yearbook staff members will be in room 104 to collect your photos. This Friday is the absolute deadline. See Ms. Kennedy for more information. Tonight is a senior parent night. Seniors, if you haven't ordered your class ring, cap and gown, or announcements, be sure to stop by the Herf Jones table in the lower commons from 5 to 6 p.m. The senior parent meeting starts at 6 p.m. in the auditorium. You and your parent will want to attend this meeting to receive important information about graduation. Seniors, the FAFSA process can be a difficult challenge to most adults. If you come to the Senior Parent Financial Aid and FAFSA night on Tuesday, November 15th at 6 p.m. in the library, Pikes Peak Community College will have experts to help you navigate the FAFSA process. Bring tax information to maximize this opportunity. If you have questions, contact Mr. Hall in the Counseling Center at this number or by email. Hey, Miss Betsy, what's cooking? Good morning! It's Wednesday! Super nachos for lunch. Come and join us. Have a great day. Oh, that sounds good. Students, do you have a really cool photo that only lives on Snapchat or Instagram? Why not send it to the yearbook staff so they can publish it in this year's yearbook? Give your Instagram and Snapchat photos new life by sending them to this email address. Remember to order your yearbooks now before the $60 price go up. See Miss Kennedy or any st yearbook staff members to order your your book today. Now here are Dylan Mack, Elijah Clark, and Dylan Ham with your sports update. Good morning, lads. I'm Dylan Mack with Dylan Ham and Elijah Clark out in the field. And this is your Gladiator Sports Update. Boys Varsity Soccer played Harrison Panthers last night. On Thursday, Cross Country holds its regional tournament. With more information, let's throw it out to Dylan Ham and Elijah Clark on the field. Thanks, Dylan. We are here at the side of the Cross Country Regional Meet that is tomorrow. Where Whitefield takes on 24 other teams in their region, vying for state. Come out and support Cole Munoz, Max Martinez, and the rest of your Cross Country team as the boys run at 3.30 and the girls run at 4.30. I'm Elijah Clark. I'm Dylan Ham. Back to you, Dylan. Thanks, guys. Some other games on Thursday include volleyball at Woodland Park at 6 and soccer with its last home game here against Canyon City at 6. Go out and support your glad. On Friday, football has last home game against Plo Centennial. It is a pink night and a senior night. Come out and support the glad. Glads, it's not too late to buy the raffle ticket to win the autographed Tampa Bay Bucks jersey from Widefield alum Vincent Jackson. Tickets are valuable from Miss Price in the main office or you can buy them at Friday's home game. The drawing will be that night and you don't need to be present to win. Ladies Open Gym for Girls Basketball continues on Mondays and Wednesdays in Bowers Gym from 6 to 7.30 p.m. until the season starts in November. Stop by, the, stop by to hone some skills and practice those drills. Ladies interested in joining the swim and dive teams, Miss Wickberg is holding a meeting today at lunch in room 110. If you are unable to attend the meeting, please contact Miss Wigberg for details. The Power Powder Puffs game scheduled for October 27th has been postponed until the spring. Finally, glad if you are planning to play a winter sport, please stop by the main office to get a yellow card or get a physical packet if you haven't filled one out yet. Winter sports practices start on November 11th. I'm Dylan Mack with Dylan Ham and Elijah Clark. Have a good Wednesday. Back to you, John and Jaden. Thanks guys. To all those students who auditioned for the school musical, callbacks will be tomorrow. Good luck. 
If you're writing a story for the yearly Security Public Library Story Contest, the deadline is next Sunday. Are you in the club? If so, be sure to make it to your meetings on time. Today, club meetings information include Gladiator Tabletop After School and Lab 60, 160, Welding Club and Medals until 4 p.m., Deca Club at lunch in Lab 159, 180 Club in Room 5 at lunch, Environmental Club in Mr. Cummings' Room 204. Uh, also, if you missed the forensics meeting on Monday, see Miss. Owens for additional information. Glads, remember you are able to dress up for Halloween. Please do not ruin this wonderful opportunity by wearing clown costumes. Disciplinary actions will be taken. And finally, remember that we have a late start tomorrow. Classes will begin at 9.33. Have a great Wednesday, guys. I'm Jada McDonald. And I'm John Christofferson. And this was your KWHS News. Oh,